Hi everyone, Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com. We finally knocked this out, thank you very much. 2021-22, Panini Chronicles Draft Picks Basketball, featuring the latest draft class right here. According to, the, there's the Wikipedia page right there. It's a random letter break. It's the first letter of their first name. So Evan Mobley will go to E. Cade Cunningham goes to C, so on and so forth. 18 total spots, all card ship, only two packs per box, two autographs per box. And a lot of fun parallels here, and there are all the letters right there. Big thanks to this group for getting your spots straight up, and congrats again to the people who won their spots. I appreciate you taking a chance on those fillers. And there's all the letters right there. First letters of their first name. Let's roll it, randomize it. Six and a five, 11 times, names and letters. One, two, three, four, five, six. And 11 the final time, we got Brian Frank and Chris Maxwell. Oh, sorry, that was from a different break. I have the spreadsheet set up for this break. Where is it? There it is. So you can see the title right there, Chronicles Draft Picks, 8 box, blah, 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 blah. All right, so once again, Brian down to Chris and everybody in between. There's Brian down to Chris. Six and a five, 11 times for the letters. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10 and 11th and final time. After 11, we got the UZ YV combo letter down to L. All right, so Brian with the UV YZ combo, Brian with T, Mark with E, Arthur with D, it says Ted right there. Nick with F, Carl with A, free agent. Richard with G, Terry with the NQ combo letter. Alan with J, Carl with I, Richard with M, Alan with C, Chris with H, Alan with B, Richard with R. If we pull any Richard Johansons, it'll go to you, Richard. Chris with K, different, different Chris. Carl with S, not Chris with a K. And Chris with L. Let's order these alphabetically. And we're gonna pause the video. When we come back, we're gonna see if there's any trades and then we'll have the break. Stick around, BRB. All right, welcome back everybody. No deals were done and everyone seemed pretty comfortable with their letters. No one was really saying anything. So there you go, random letter break number one. Eight boxes, half a case, good luck. Thanks everyone. I think I'm gonna have to change that toner tomorrow. I've done the shaking of the toner few times already over the last few days so I think it's I think it'll be time all right so there should be yeah eight on the left and right side right here so we'll go one, two, three for the left side and four, five, six for the right side. It's two. So left side, this we will save for some other time. All right, so there'll be some blue X's there so we know it's from the same case. Now let's take a look at what's inside here. Four autographs or memorabilia cards per box on average. It's only two packs per box. Break shouldn't take too long. Let's see what we got here. Yeah, Joe about to go late again tonight. We're saying, right, yeah, people fill up breaks. That's what I'll do. That's what I'll do. All right. Again, first letter of their first name and all cards ship. So that's actually 
pretty nice. There you go. Ooh. So who are we? I mean, I guess some of the couple of the main, the top names that I'm looking for right now would be the, I guess the first few picks at, at least. I know, I mean, all cards will ship so you'll be getting everything, but Cade Cunningham, Jalen Green, Evan Mobley are the one, two, three right here. Hey, there's a Cade Cunningham right here. Rated rookie, your number one overall to the Pistons. Pistons gonna be an interesting team this year. And there's Cade Cunningham again, triple relic, tools of the trade, five out of 99, letter C for Cade, Alan Matsui. And our autograph is Romello White, 27 out of 99, Richard with a letter R. There's Jalen Suggs, who I think is he's still a top, he's a top five pick, yeah. It's going to be, I have to, I have to sort of, there's Jalen Green, I have to re-familiarize myself with a whole new draft class. Of course, Chronicles is always fun because you get to kind of see, it's like a little sampler platter of, uh, of some future products. Jalen Green for Allen. There's an Evan Mobley. Seen him a little bit playing uh, those UCLA games. Evan Mobley, Mark with the letter E. There's Joel Ay Ayayi. Kind of trip. I, I, I want. I want to say Ajaye. Like remember old football player Jay Ajaye. But no, Ayaye. Letter J gets the relic, and then we got Eugene. Eugene Omarui, forty-one out of one ninety-nine. Autograph for the letter E. Mark Dominguez. So remember, all of these cards will ship. So in case I miss any like sort of key players that have been selling well on the secondary market early, don't worry, it'll, it'll all be going to you. There's Jared Butler, seven out of 10, a Baylor Bear. There's Cade Cunningham in that mosaic format in his college gear, it goes to Allen, C for Cade. We got Scotty uh, Scotty Barnes. I feel like I've heard of him. Yeah, he was fourth round pick or fourth pick overall in the first round. Thirteen out of forty nine going to uh, Carl in the letter S. Was there a that's was there a gala Davion Mitchell in here? Oh yeah, there it is. Oh, those are, I was thinking thicker cards for the. Yes, he does use the same number as Donovan Mitchell. It's for uh, Oliver's Kings. Letter D, uh, that's, that's Brad King with the Kings. Letter D, at least with the Davions. Nice, all cards will ship, Oliver. I'll end up sleeving all the cards. This break will take an hour long. But all, all, all these guys, I mean, at least the number one overall pick, we're gonna take care of right away, and the numbered cards right here. There's Jalen Suggs. Oh, and an autograph. That's to 199. Letter J. And LJ Figueroa autograph for L, Chris Maxwell with the letter L. Oh, 
Oh, I see, I see. Yeah, Oliver's just highlighting some of the guys that jump out to him. There's another Davion Mitchell right there. I like this select design. This might be even a, this probably would be a courtside peril and proper, and select proper. Oliver, you watch, you watch a lot of college basketball. I mean, is Cade Cunningham, Jalen Green, Evan Mobley, those top three guys, are they supposed to be the real deal? Holyfield? There's a Nemeas Queda, N. That will be for Terry. Now, from what from what little I remember from watching the draft, there's Jay Huff. I feel like a lot of the a lot of the analysts were uh, suggesting that this might be one of the deeper draft classes in a long time, which may be which may be a good thing. There's Evan Mobley to 49, which may be a good thing. Yeah, Suggs, Green, Kuminga, Cunningham, Davion Mitchell could all be really great. Yeah, there's a Cade Cunningham to 99 right here. That marquee design for Allen in the letter C. I think when we were at the National not too long ago and um, we were talking to some of the, uh, the Panini basketball guys, you know, they were, they were also excited about basketball products for, for this 2021-22 class because of all the indications that this could be a really deep draft class. So there'll be a lot of players, a lot of different players to chase. That also means, like, pick your team pricing-wise whenever we get to that point later this year. That means pick your team pricing-wise. Ideally, I mean, unless there's one, one player that's, like, significantly favored in the hobby for some reason over another. But for the most part, you would hope that there would be... Um, the hope is that there will... That will the pricing will be less top-heavy is what I'm trying to spit out. There's Trey Mann. Trying to do a couple things at once. Rookie memorabilia, Florida, T. That'll be for Brian with the letter T. So, I mean, that, that, could, be, that could be great for the hobby, especially in the initial run of products, right? 54 out of 90, before any of these guys really start to emerge as the regular season goes along. But hopefully, and I haven't really looked at the secondary market numbers on these guys, but hopefully that's the... Uh, that would be the plan, or the idea, the hope. The hope would be that there'll be less top-heavy teams, things will be a little, pricing would be a little more balanced from top to bottom for the pick your teams, and then That would be good for everybody, good for the hobby. And hopefully if a lot of these rookies do well, there will be a lot of different rookies to chase and a lot of people interested. To 199, Tools of the Trade, Cameron Thomas, Triple Relic for a C. It will be for Allen. Jalen Johnson to 149, J. Allen. Jonathan Kuminga, J. Allen. Cade Cunningham, C. Allen. And Alan, Alan's got a lot of nice teams here. And a jersey and autograph, Jalen Suggs, 86 out of 99, your number five overall pick. Went to, uh, went to Orlando. This is Mo Wagner's brother right there, Franz Wagner, who's supposed to be maybe a, maybe a better, better scorer than him. I mean, there's a lot going on here. So there's the Jalen Green, your second overall pick, which a lot of people think should have gone to two. That's the Rockets pick. There's Davion Mitchell, rated rookie hollow.
for letter D, that'll be for Brad King, the latest King. Got an Evan Mobley out of select. Oliver was saying Cameron Thomas had a good summer league. You know, the, there's Io Dosumu, more Evan Mobley's, and Kuminga's. Jonathan Kuminga for Allen and the letter J. So I don't know. I'm excited about this. Uh, I'm excited for the season to finally get underway. I have to slog through, you know, slog through all this uh, preseason stuff. Get get the players warmed up and ready for the season. And we can start seeing them seeing them play. Oh, uh, that Suggs was certified Suggs, about 300 bucks. Nice. And we got an Evan Mobley relic. Looks like the relic and the autograph are right next to each other in each of those packs. And the Trojans red, USC red, E. For Mark Dominguez and C. Chude Bile to 49. I think the, the Hoyas were a sort of a darling pick last year to, to do some damage in the tournament. A lot, of, a lot of J. J is a great letter. Got a rookie relic. There's Matthew Hurt, 75 out of 199 M for Richard in the letter M. Duke player, or I don't know where he was drafted, maybe a second rounder. I don't know if he was, he might be undrafted. Hoping that he'd be on this list here, Richard. Sorry. It's Cade Cunningham again. And there's Jalen Johnson, two color jersey and autograph. Five out of ten. What is that? From Illusions? That's an Illusions design there. Alan Matsui with Jay. Jalen Johnson, your uh, your number. Where was he drafted? Twentieth overall. He went to uh, late first round pick. Went to Atlanta. Charles Bassey to one forty nine. And then we got some Cade Cunninghams here. And the pick right behind him, Jalen Green. So all of these will be top loaded before they're shipped out, of course, before they're sorted and shipped. Next two here.
We got Isaiah Jackson for the letter I. 121 out of 199. Tools of the Trade Triple Relic for Carl and I. Another Cade Cunningham for Allen. And we got a Justin Turner. Red turn two? No, this is Justin Turner, basketball player. That is two out of 99. Another letter, J. J is strong in this. Davion Mitchell. Jalen Green. Cade Cunningham. More Jalen Green, Mosaic Silver this time. Loaders in the queue here. More Davion Mitchell. And we have Josh Christopher. 62 out of 99. Rookie memorabilia. Another letter J. And there's Franz Wagner. Jersey and autograph. Wagner. 98 out of 99, jersey and autograph. I think him and his brother went to the same college. His brother was a few years ahead of him, I think. A handful of years ahead of him, maybe. But there he is, letter F, Nick L, with the jersey and auto. And that gold standard design, look, which looks really sharp. There we got a recon, Cade Cunningham. Jaden Springer to 149. We got a Zaire Williams to 149. XR design that goes to Brian Frank with the letter Z. And there's the Gala card, which, which do look really sharp. Evan Mobley, letter E for the number three overall pick, Mark Dominguez. All right, three boxes to go. Yeah, I guess Jay does pretty much kill this break. I don't know, there's some, there's some M's out there, some letter C's. Cade Cunningham here. A Trey Mann to 99. Rookie memorabilia for Brian and the letter T. Let's switch these, put that over here, that over here. And we got an Origins Auto. 150 out of 199. Vrenz. Vrenz. Bligenberg. Going to letter V, that'll be for Brian Frank with those combo letters. All right, we got... Jalen Green, second pick. Evan Mobley, third pick. Kate Cunningham, your number one overall pick in that marquee design. Blyenberg, is it Blyenberg? Q 
Keon Johnson, rookie memorabilia for Chris and the letter K. I always like how the, uh, there's Evan Mobley in that luminance design, which I always think looks, looks incredibly sharp. And a Jalen Suggs, gold standard jersey and autograph, 62 out of 99. Another one for Allen, different design though. And he got that letter J with the spot that he won in, the, uh, in that filler break. So that's really paying off. Next to 49, that's Isaiah Jackson. Two more boxes to go. Redemption. Who's not signing their cards? Who's not signing their cards? There's Brandon Boston Jr. Relic to 199. That'll be for Allen and the letter B. Allen gets all those Cunninghams too. Keon Johnson for letter K to 49. Cade Cunningham again, another Keon Johnson, 63 out of 99. Oliver's gonna guess Josh Christopher, okay. Ooh, Davion Mitchell Relic. Triple Relic, 81 out of 99. Arthur, or Brad King in the chat. The autograph is DJ Funderburg, 40 out of 49. Deej going to King. The redemption is going to be John Petty Jr. in flight signatures. John Petty Jr., what, what, what's he doing now? He's He is an undrafted free agent. Is he attached to a team? This goes to letter J, another J for Allen, but it doesn't look like it. He is the all-time three-point scoring leader for Alabama. He got that record in 2021. Doesn't seem like he's attached to a team. I don't know, maybe he's working on... Uh... Oh no, I think he was... Uh... Well, as of early August, as of early August, it looks like he was, he was with the, uh, the Pistons he was on the Pistons Summer League team. Yeah, maybe maybe he's racing cars now. The basketball thing doesn't work out. All right, final two. Good luck, everybody.
All right, we got Cade Cunningham right there on top. We got Matthew Hurt, Triple Relic, Tools of the Trade for M. Richard. Ooh, and Evan Mobley? That's the autograph spot. No, oh, Double Relic. I got trolled there. 61 out of 199. Two relics in this one. There's the autograph. Oh, Mark with the letter E. Sorry, Mark. I, my, I got excited right there. 24 out of 49. We got, instead, we have Georgi uh, Bezhani Shavili. Bezhani Shavili. I'm going to try that. Did my best, Georgi. That'll be for Richard and the letter G. There's the Cade Cunningham in the flux design. And nice Cade Cunningham. I really do like this uh, gala design here. I don't know if these... I'm sure some parallels will do better than other parallels, but, but to me, that looked pretty sharp. All right, last box. Last pack of the last box. We got Joe Ayayi. 93 out of 149, Joel Ayayi. I have to work on that this fall. Another letter J. And we got Sandro Mamu Kela Shavili to 199. Got a similar last name ending as the uh, the other character here. I mean, perhaps they're perhaps they're a countryman. Perhaps. That goes to S. That'll be for Carl. Last bot mojo strikes again. 70% of the time, last bot mojo hits. 100% of the time. And there's Charles Bassey right there to 140. And there you go, ladies and gentlemen. A nice quick break of 2021-22 Panini Chronicles Draft Picks Basketball. Hope springs eternal with all these players. Hopefully they all turn out to be great, which would be awesome for the hobby. We know it's not, we know it doesn't work like that, but we see all these guys and we're hoping we want them to be big names in the hobby, household names. And hopefully they'll do well. Thanks for watching, everybody. I'm Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com. I'll see you next time for the next basketball break. And join us all season long. As, as the regular season for hoops starts to get underway, I'm sure we'll be breaking a lot more basketball, talking a lot more basketball. And um, so join us all fall and winter long. Thanks, everybody. JaspiesCaseBreaks.com. Bye-bye.